And now guys, on your brand new celebrity update, Master KG sues the German government and other companies for using his song Jerusalem to benefit themselves. And now for more on this story, just stay tuned to this video. Now guys, welcome back to Mzanzi a -list. The one channel you can learn for updates on your favorite celebrities. And if you're new here, please subscribe and the notification bell so that you can notified every time we upload a new video. <laughs> And now guys, it looks like Master KG is going after companies and organizations that actually use this song, Jerusalem, to actually benefit themselves. And now, just to retrack back, if you guys still remember, there was some sort of Jerusalem challenge when institutions, companies, and organizations from all around the world were actually doing this challenge all over internet and social media. But according to recent reports, Master KG has been going after most of those companies after they sort of indulged in that challenge, not for the sake of the challenge, but but only just to benefit their brands and without paying licensing fee to do that. And now according to an AFP report, the German government in Berlin actually said on Monday that it was forced to fork out licensing fees in thousands of euros to the Warner Music Group which is the label that actually sort of bought the masters to Master KG's Jerusalem song. If you don't know about it, Open Mic Productions which is a South African company did some sort of deal with Warner Bros earlier last year just to have the song actually in their position. And so as it seems Warner Music Group has been actually going after brands who actually have been using the song and the challenge to benefit themselves and not just for the sake of doing the challenge. And while there has been some sort of worry from normal individuals who actually did take part in the challenge, but according to Eyewitness News, they did speak to an entertainment lawyer, Dumisan Mutamai, who actually did say that normal people who actually just took part in the challenge have nothing to worry about. It is actually the big brands and organizations who actually might have to fork out big licensing fees to master KG's label for actually partaking in the challenge. And while there has been positive and negative responses from this challenge, firstly in the positive one, most people actually did agree that man, most songs actually have been sort of exploited with the owner of the song not actually getting what is due to them. And it is good to see Master KG's label actually collecting royalties and fees on his behalf properly because evidently his song was widely used. Whereas some other people are actually saying that man, this might have negative effects in the songs that he drops in the future because less people are actually going to be willing to actually partake in the challenges of his songs because they might be afraid to face legal challenges in future but anyway you guys tell me what you think about it do you think this was the right move or not comment down in the comment section below and i will respond to your comments with my own thoughts as well and just as that guys will come to the end of this video and if you guys like this video please give a thumbs up because it actually does up the channel and please do not forget to subscribe for more updates on your favorite celebrities